Well, if you're looking to get out on the waterways this week and your travels take you to the Seneca River, the Onondaga County Sheriff's Office says you need to slow down. The navigation unit issuing a no-wake order Sunday afternoon asking boaters don't go over five miles an hour. But as News Channel 9's Julia LeBlanc shows us, many people are not following the rules. You got to go slower. Like when you were approaching us at the end, it was a much better speed. Sheriff's deputies with the navigation unit surveying the Seneca River, stopping boaters going against the no-wake zone put into place on Sunday. There was a lot of angry people on the shoreline upset at the boats that were flying around going way over speed for the conditions. The water is higher, murkier, and moving faster than normal. The debris sitting beneath the surface putting everyone at risk. That's a floating dock, which would normally be down, but it, the water's pushed it right up, and the water's actually behind it up to their steps. The sheriff's office issuing 42 warnings Sunday afternoon, not just for enforcement, but also to educate boaters about the damage their wakes could cause, such as erosion, which has uprooted that tree back there. What we're looking for is obviously the smallest possible ripple you can make behind your boat. If I see any waves behind your boat that are white capping or, or folding over, you'll see the white water. You're definitely going too fast. Going slower also means you may catch something in the water before hitting it. But if someone catches you picking up speed and causing damage to their property, they are civilly res uh, responsible for that. And then if we're out patrolling and we observe, Infractions, they can be issued citations for that as well. Be respectful, use common sense. You know, you're going to have to plan extra time, go slow, and please just look behind you and watch your weight. Because even small boats can cause big problems. It didn't feel like we were going very fast, and honestly, I didn't look behind us to, to look at the weight. Yeah, just be careful. Thanks. On the Seneca River, Julia LeBlanc, News Channel 9. And sheriff's deputies say the no wake zone will stay in effect as long as the water. Levels stay so high, they say it will line up when the Canal Corporation reopens the locks in the area.